What's up, guys? It's Monday. You see Joe's here. He's an old faithful because his tool truck still not tool trucking. So it is what it is. But it's Monday, and Joe's here. He's reliable. Another great day. That's it. All right, guys. Let's see what he's got. Let's do it. doing another great day so uh i hope you all had a good weekend we've had cooler weather nice it is nice very nice it is, it's about time now <laughs> if we just need a little rain i think we're supposed to get some of that so might be too late for anything to grow but um i'm not going to get any taller if i stand out there so i'd say the rain just wait and come next spring yeah save well, it till we need it now hey we need it but anyways um Got a few tools to show you. Okay. Gonna start with some uh, torque wrenches mm -hmm. from Gear Wrench. That part number right here. Okay. It's digital with angle. They flex. It gives you, you know, with angle, it gives you uh, newtometers, foot pounds, inch pounds. Uh, they do a good job with these. Yep. They've changed the design. I've got a gear wrench. Mine's got a metal handle with a like aluminum screw on cap. So yeah, this here the battery goes on bit. the end, and or two batteries go on the end. Uh, the quarter inch one is three sixty five, and then I got the three eighths one. That's in there. Yep. And again, it flexes, gives you angle, inch pounds. It's 225, 250 foot pounds. Okay. It goes, these here go in streaks, and right now they're going in a streak. So, um, this is a 415. Okay. So, a couple of these. Everybody's favorite here, we got Vim. Mm -hmm. It's FRBS 89 for. You guessed it, if you go and count, 89 pieces. Yep. But this here kit is is a favorite. You got push button locking. You got this here being a regular extension and they're all magnetic. Yep. But you can also take this and if you lined up the squiggly lines with the dot, if I can do that, <laughs> you got a T handle. Oh yeah. Um, multi-useful but you can also use the t-handle here and it's magnetic as a driver on this side as well right um, what's cool with this set is take like your 10 millimeter these are ultra low profile sockets you see when you put it in there look how low profile that becomes it's like right there yeah that's not an inch so, Not even an inch. Super, super, super slim. So this set is really cool, guys. It goes, it goes to five. A five all the way up to a 10 millimeter in your sockets, and it does have a 5.5 in it. It comes with a bit driver, yeah. all of your different bits. And it pulled out the, the five millimeter just to show you how little that thing could be. Yep. And what's cool with these is, obviously, these are one inch bits, as you can see how long they are here. But when you put them in the ratchet, they go all the way to the back of the ratchet. So it's pretty low profile. If you need something lower than that, the VHC 77 kit, which is the half cut bits. It's less than, less than an inch. So great set there. Put the price and, on that one. And it's got part numbers for all yep. the pieces. So you're missing a piece you can easily identify it and say hey i need this here part number to get it replaced uh these are 145. okay um and this is everybody's favorite i don't i don't know many of my guys that do not have this set yep that's well, a good um, set it's a great set i mean it's got it's got everything in here 89 pieces you gotta find something that's got it <laughs> so that's it um 
I was talking, I was going to have something new from Milwaukee. Yep. Uh, I got the new Milwaukee 3 8. It's got the shorter face. It's got the three lights. The three lights on the face make a big difference when you're trying to put it on something. Um, you can see what it is versus the little light right here. Yep. But it also has, for this little thing, 550 foot pounds of torque. Wow. For a 12 volt. It's Pretty light, impressive. it's compact. I mean, I feel that thing. That is, that is definitely something up there. I had, I thought I grabbed a 3 8 so I'd have to compare it. So this is the newest one that they the newest just The newest one right out, yeah. Got a little torque to it. So compared to the 18 volt 3 8 and if we put a battery on here, we're like right here, but yep. they found what battery you put on here. This weighs probably about what the battery weighs. Mm -hmm. So that's a pretty cool design right there. The new way they did that what's the cost and, on that and then uh they are 325 okay and they teach people how to read i said so you don't have to learn how to read you put it in neutral you hit the button two times to change oh, the setting the oh. setting because it is so powerful you don't want to be in 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 like one for something like a small size eight millimeter or something and find that like all of a sudden you've got 550 foot pounds of torque mm -hmm. twisting it off because it will and well, you got cool. your you got your neat little pocket uh yeah. hanger and i don't know any mechanic that uses that i, don't, I took them off everywhere. <laughs> that's for your quick draw they always got in the way so it's a new uh, from Milwaukee. It is uh, something I mentioned. I was going to have new uh, coming up here. Cool. Ordered these. I don't know how long ago. It was a couple months ago. Mm -hmm. Pre-ordered. Just the day they came in, I went and reordered them the same batch again, and these were all gone within two days, and I was already wow. putting names on the other ones. So. Well, what's the update on the tool truck? Are you are you just gonna have uh, to scrap the damn thing, or what's, uh, I, what's the I, deal? I came I came along the road here, and there were a bunch of uh, police cars, a fire truck, and all this. It was a bad accident, but nope. Some guy in a jeep beat me to it. His jeep was all burned up on the side of the road. He beat me to it. <laughs> uh, I'm not sure what I'm doing. So is the holdup with Ford, or is the holdup with the warranty company, the, the, or the, the mechanic the shop? Ford, the the holdup is with Ford Motor Company warranty. There's a guy in Detroit sitting up there in his office saying, we're not going to warranty this, even though it's a brand new long block from Ford, and nine months into the warranty, 17,000 miles on this long block, and he doesn't want to warranty it. Mm. And uh, so, what's the dealership? They're not trying to hit the, you. The dealership's trying to help, but the guy up there, he's a guy that's stopping everything. And I've talked to him a few times, and they've talked to him a few times, and I just need me a lawyer that beats Ford Motor Company because that sounds like some to, horse shit from forward then it is i mean that's ridiculous it is it's uh beyond that i mean you're you're getting by obviously in your truck but look look what it's doing to your business by not having everything you need I'm you know losing every month i can show that and it's going to when we come down to nitty-gritty and you know or i gotta look at buying another ford motor for umpteen thousands of dollars only to have the same shit happen again and yeah that's stupid i'd but, be looking at something with a cummins in it if i was you yeah. i've been trying to see if somebody could put uh, a different motor like a cummins or something into that transit because you know it's all fixed up inside and i uh you know joe it's kind of like your dog 
you love it to death, but you don't want to see it suffer no more, it may be time to just Pull move on. Pull out the old 45 on. and yeah. put it out. Take it out behind the barn, you know. Yeah, there's... Find you a freight shaker. Cummins in it. Something. Move on. But yeah. Something's... Don't even look at a blue oval anymore. Something's going to happen. There you go. So, again, I um, hope you guys all have a uh, great week. Um, we're Beautiful enjoying this weather, weather so Absolutely. I hope you're all great enjoying weather. good weather. I hope you all have a great and a safe week ahead. Thank you. There you go. All right, guys, if you need anything from Joe, his number's right down here at 731-412-7295. Like always, thanks for hanging out with us on this Monday. Hit that thumbs up. Check over for merchandise. Cool tools and discount codes in the description. We're not subscribed. You take your finger and you click that button. It's free. That's it. Have a great weekend. See ya.